What's up guys? We're here at Whitpain Township Municipal Building. Vietnam uh, World War II actually memorial here. I'm here with Southeastern PA Community Watch. Making our rounds. Let's see they have a bunch of memorials here. Killed in Europe, buried in the Netherlands. Pretty cool, man. Wow. You got bricks that people paid money to put their names on and stuff. You got a little bench here to sit down. Do you have a right to know form? Yeah, it'll be back behind you on the wall on the left hand side. Perfect, thank you. Alright, another township doing it right, huh? Oh, they have a bunch of stuff here, that's cool. Let's see, right to know request. There you go. She was not lying, good for her. So, yeah, there's one thing I did not see out here. Permission slips. Permission slips. That's what they are. Look at all these permission slips. Lots and lots of permission slips. Permission. Yeah, permission. Something tells me our founding fathers wouldn't agree with that. Over here. You can go ahead and hit the bell if you need help. Thanks. Oh, okay, thank you. It's good to see you guys got these forms out in the lobby. That's good. Yeah, but just relax. How are you doing? How are you doing? Good, yep. Good. Um, this is where everybody would be able to come to get um, zoning permission? Yes. Oh. For, for permits, for building permits, for the yeah. zoning variances, yes, for zoning questions, building questions, yes, where you come. All right, great. Um, I was just um, going around and seeing um, what you guys offer here in this building. So um, The building itself? Or? Yeah, the different services that are provided. Right, yeah, so this is code enforcement, so we do building permits, all the permits you see here, uh, zoning here, but applications, which is for variances, condition on uh, conditional uses as well. All right. Uh, can you appeal? Board of appeal. Board of appeal. Can you appeal violations here? Too? Yes, you can. Okay, great, cool. Well, if you have a, depends, if you have a zoning violation, right. yes, you can appeal that to the zoning hearing board. If you have a building issue that doesn't meet the code, you can appeal to the board of appeals. Okay. If you have a property maintenance, issue you can appeal to and you go to court district court down the street you right, that's just what they ask you that's how it's handled and you would go to a district court that's for property maintenance yes okay what, a, what about appeals well what's the specific Good. issue well like say like somebody like builds a fence on their yard and then like you know the zone the, the zoning and code enforcement comes and they tell you that you know you didn't get our permission or whatever or somebody wants to widen their you know driveway and the driveway would be engineering which is the other window the okay are. Yeah. Uh, yeah. But, unless it, unless the driveway results in an increase in impervious coverage because right. it was permitted per zone. Yeah, so somebody could appeal that, right? Like, say somebody, a code enforcement officer comes and issues a citation for something that was built on a property, a shed. Yeah, you could appeal that, yeah. And then you can, you can hand your appeal in here, right? Yes, an appeal could be, and then, like it's a zoning issue, it's a zoning here, what application. And zoning's around there, engineering? And engineering is each other window. Okay. Yeah. All right. So they have all the answers for those questions. For engineering questions. For, oh, for engineering. Okay. I'm just for zoning, for the code enforcement. That's right here. Okay. So well, once they hand in an appeal for that, what would be the process? Like, where would they go? Would they go to a court? Would they go to a meeting here? For the zoning, the appeals is to the zoning hearing board, and that's a meeting. They meet monthly. That's okay. The zoning hearing board okay. There Great. Five, um, Residents of the township are appointed by the Board of Supervisors without elected people to appoint it. Oh, I agree. And you go to them, you put an application in by the third Tuesday of the month to be heard the third Thursday of the following month. Oh, great, great. The okay. Appeals meet monthly, too. So they see you in person, they don't just make a decision on paper and mail it to you. 
No, no. Okay, you, great. You have to go and present. Well, that's great. Case and everything. Well, uh, yeah, it works right. out better. Yeah. 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 All yeah. right, great, man. Thanks. Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Appreciate yeah. it. Yeah. And then, um, yeah, where is engineering at? Engin- engineer. I'm not. There's one person here. Yeah. You, if you ask at the other window, you can speak to someone in engineering. Okay. Thanks. Yep. Yeah, yeah, thanks. Did you get your answers? Uh, yeah, pretty much. I don't really have any more questions. Okay, we'll go around back. My kid kept on saying, I saw some spotted lantern flies in our yard or whatever. Okay. I'm like, yeah. Man. Is it a new fly or something? So they're spotted or not, they spread outside the existing. They, they must be in an endangered, not endangered, but a, um, you know, a, a species that. Harmful. Yeah, that is like there's new species that come in sometimes with different currents and shit. When I was out in California, they had at this vector control, they were saying something about um, the tiger fish mosquito or something. Really? And it was new and it came from Asia, and they were trying to tell people exactly that could get you sick. So uh, I saw this business card there or whatever, so I got to bring it home and show him. It's like, yeah, he was right. It must be some invasive um, insect. Yeah, this is crazy. That's the tax collectors who were just there. Yeah, they all got tax collectors, huh? Me and Dan Shop. A public yeah. meeting room. Hey, Dan Shop. You're welcome. Stuff. Some old watering holes. You got a keypad in restricted area, I believe. It's dark in there. There we go. Boom, 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 boom. their mission statement up on the wall too but can they recite it pop quiz time um what's this right here yeah, that's an application for something else I don't see him out in the lobby. I was hoping they were. I wouldn't have to bother you. A police complaint form? Well, it's a um, internal affairs complaint form. Internal affairs complaint form. Say one more time for me. When a citizen is like mistreated by a uh, public official, there's these complaint forms called uh, internal affairs complaint forms. Gotcha. Give me one yeah. second. Thanks. I wonder if they just all like go to one place. Let me see if there's a place where they can put these. Right here in the counter. Boom. Okay. Please complaint form. Has a please complaint forms written all over this area. (laughs) 
This is a pretty big building, guys. Check this out, man. Pretty cool. We got like a loft up here. Oh no, not a loft. It's just a beam. Oh, this is the timeline. I don't think it might. I don't know if it's that interesting here. Oh, perfect. Very, very nice. Thank you so much. Okay. Yeah. So this one's complaint for me. I guess that's, uh, whoops, sorry. Very good. Alright. Well, good. Is there any way there can be like a stack of these out here for the public? That's a good question. They should Just be out in the uh, lobby. Any chance we can get them out in the lobby so I don't have to bother you guys next time? You think? Yeah, we'll put a stack out. Very good. Have a lovely day. Thank you. Yo. Did you hear the guy? Yep, he sense. said it gets it gets windy in the, lobby, windy in the lobby and they blow away. <laughs> but there's all kinds of other forms in the lobby yeah. that don't get blown away. Yeah, the, the other ones look all stacked neatly. <laughs> I don't get it. <laughs> That's classic. What a guy. Oh my God. <laughs> yeah, I heard that excuse. I'm like, uh, My yeah. camera picks up pretty good audio. I hope it comes up on it. Yes. Uh, I'll put the subtitles in. That's ridiculous. You know, she asked me if I put them out in the lobby. <laughs> well, yeah. And it was a cop, and he was hiding as far in the corner as he could.